<laughs> Good morning. slept well. I'm still a little tired. <laughs> My voice is a little raspy. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> well, well, yeah, I guess there's nothing to be sorry about. I don't know, I just... You know me, I say sorry a lot. <laughs> How did you sleep? <sighs> That's good. I don't even know what time it is, but I just want to stay right here. Mm -hmm. It's so warm. And you're so warm. And the blankets are just too comfy, and I just I want to go back to sleep. But... Oh gosh, it's that late already. I mean, it is the weekend, so I mean, I guess it's not that bad that we woke up that late, but we can lay down at least for a few more minutes, and then we can go and have some breakfast or or whatever. Today is just a whatever day. <laughs> Whatever day spending with you in our new apartment. I think it's finally just sinking in, you know? We're living together now, and I get to wake up next to you every single day. <laughs> yeah, you're in for quite a treat, aren't you? <laughs> oh, you're too sweet. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, I look horrible and you know it. I just woke up. <laughs> uh oh. My hair is probably a mess or something. I probably look like a zombie. <laughs> no, stop it. Stop it. No. Oh, okay, okay, okay. If you say so. Hmm. I think you look really cute, too. Especially in the morning light. So what are you thinking for breakfast? Hmm? Maybe we can have... Cereal? <laughs> We can make something else, I guess. I'm just so tired. <laughs> hmm. We could... We could make pancakes, or... <laughs> we could have Pop-Tarts. Which, I don't even know how that's considered breakfast these days, but I guess it is. Um... Or we could... Make some kind of eggs. Scrambled... Sunny side up, over easy. I feel like yours hard boiled. <laughs> trying to think what else we have in the fridge. I know we have some fruit in the fridge. Or, um, I don't know. What do you think? Okay. I think we can do that. We'll make waffles. Besides, I just got that new waffle maker. <laughs> it was a present from my mom for when we moved in together. We can put it to good use. And if you want, we can put some blueberries or strawberries on it. Because we got that fruit in the fridge. <laughs> or whipped cream. <laughs> Which, again, that's not really much for breakfast now, is it? But I think we should treat ourselves today. So... I know. We should probably get up. I don't want to. <laughs> okay, okay, we can get up. <laughs> oh. oh, God. 
gosh, my elbow cracked. I told you I'm falling apart. Okay. You lead the way. And the floor is so cold on my feet. It was a lot more warmer under the blanket, you know. <laughs> well, yeah, yeah, we, we do need to eat after all. And maybe after we eat, we can, you know, just relax. Alright, let's see. Um, where did we put that dang waffle maker? Um, oh, there it is. It's <laughs> still in the box. Uh, at least we know it's new. Hmm. Okay, you can get the, um, the waffle mix out of the pantry. I'll go and um, unbox this thing. <laughs> well, not I'll grab the food out of the fridge. And then uh, we can get on to waffle making. <laughs> hmm. Alrighty, um, there we go. And um, Oh, yeah, I got that bowl out. You can just pour that in there. Mm-hmm. Uh, we just need to, uh, stir this all together and then, uh, make a waffle. I think the instructions say all we have to do is just wait for, um, the steam to stop coming out, or I think it has a beep or something, one of the two. I mean, we can't mess it up. I'm sure we'll be fine. I think. <laughs> oh. All right. Mm-hmm. Here, yeah, you can just pour that in now. And then we just shut it. And now we wait. It shouldn't take too long. Thankfully, this waffle maker makes two at a time. <laughs> hmm. You know, I really like this. Well, I, you know, just making breakfast with you, it's... It's really nice. You know... Just, <laughs> like, it's so mundane and it's so normal, but it's one of the most enjoyable things, if that makes sense. I, I don't know. <laughs> Maybe it doesn't, but it does to me. <laughs> well, I'm happy you like making breakfast with me, too. <laughs> oh? Oh, cool. All right, cool. It's already done. Well, what do you know? We actually didn't mess it up completely. <laughs> All right. Get a plate for you and a plate for me. And then, uh, oh, grab some of the fruit that we have over here if you so choose to have some. <laughs> right, come on. Let's sit down and eat. <laughs> so, what do you want to do for the rest of the day, huh? We can watch something, just lay around, <laughs> go for a walk in the park, you know, whatever. Or we can actually start redecorating the place. We have all those boxes over there that we got to unload. <laughs> or, you know. Whatever is really fine with me. <laughs> that actually sounds nice. We can watch something together, and then we can, you know, get off our lazy butts and actually <laughs> unbox some of these boxes. I mean, dear gosh, how do we know what's in some of these? And then, um, just, uh, have some dinner and relax. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, these do taste pretty good. <laughs> no, hey, no, I didn't put too much syrup on mine. You have to have an adequate amount or it's just not worth it. Well, I mean, yeah. I have a little bit of a sweet tooth, okay? Just a little one. I'm a fan of many savory things, but when it comes to waffles, they do need a good adequate amount of syrup. <laughs> Let's stop it. Just finish your waffle. That way we can cuddle on the couch and watch something together. I'm sure we can find something. 
Mm. Unless, I mean, Grant, I know we've pretty much watched almost everything on Netflix, but, you know, I'm sure there's other things on the internet we could find. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I am not a fast eater. Okay, maybe I am. I'm kind of already done. <laughs> and uh, uh, we'll just throw these into the dishwasher for now. We can do the rest later. We'll just leave the cleanup to our future selves. They won't really like us very much, but you know, today's just for relaxing. <sighs> All right. <laughs> what do you want to watch? Oh, an animal documentary? You're trying to impress me? <laughs> you know how I like documentaries. Hmm. Really, you're going to let me choose? Are you sure? <laughs> don't, don't worry, I'll pick something that we'll both like, I think. Let's see. Hmm. Hmm. How about we watch a documentary about elephants? I, I know it sounds like why well, would we pick elephants, but they're really they're amazing animals, okay? I'm like a huge fan. I know when I was when I was like little, I actually wanted to be a biologist and I wanted to, you know, go to Africa or you know, I I, I love animals that are in Africa, just to be honest. I you know, elephants and giraffes and you know, rhinos and hippos and especially elephants. I don't know. I just, they're just, <laughs> elephants are just so cute and baby elephants are so cute. So I don't know. I thought maybe, and you know, they're, I mean, like, did you know that elephants are like pregnant for like 22 months? Like that's insane. And then like, you know, a little bit, you know, elephants will stay with their parents or their, I guess their mom in this case for like, they could stay up with their mom t for 10 years until they kind of branch off on their own. And I don't know. I just, I don't know. Can we watch it, please? All right, cool, cool. <laughs> you want some more elephant facts? Are you sure? I mean, we're technically watching the documentary right now. I'm sure you can just get all the facts in the documentary. <laughs> okay, okay, I guess... <laughs> I wouldn't say I look cute when I'm ranting about things I like, but <laughs> do you think so? Um, well, I mean, I think you already know, you know, there's, you know, African and Asian elephants, you know, there's the, uh, oh, what was it? How do you tell them apart again? I think, oh, oh, um, uh, their ears, uh, the ear shapes are different, so you're able to tell by that. Mm-hmm. I prefer more of the African elephants, but, uh. You know, they're both cute in their own ways. <laughs> oh, 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 they also have the largest brain size. It's, um, I only know it, I only, in the documentary, they only said it in kilograms, so I really have no idea what it is in pounds. <laughs> but it's like, I think they said around like five and a half kilograms or something like that. Like, I'm assuming that's a lot because the guy who was in the documentary was like, and it's a whopping five and a half kilograms. And I was just like, I'm assuming that's a lot. Because, <laughs> you know, if it was five and a half pounds, that's not all that impressive. But listen, I'm sorry. I don't know how to convert things offhand. <laughs> mm. Oh, look at the baby elephant. Isn't it just so cute? He's like trying to figure out how to use his trunk and everything. <laughs> oh, I love that pet. If I could have an elephant, I swear I'd be happy for the rest of my life. <laughs> yeah, I have no idea where I'd put the elephant or where he'd live. But like if I had a house that was big enough and a proper way to care for the elephant, I would totally have one. They're just so sweet. <laughs> yeah, I did see that. The elephants that like did like the paintings. Oh gosh. <laughs> I'd spoil the elephants so much. 
<laughs> hmm? Oh, um, well, um, the elephants, they're putting dirt on their backs. Will they, will they do it because, well, actually, if you didn't know, <laughs> I'm gonna sound like such like a, like one of those, like, smarticle kids, the ones that, like, the know-it-alls, but anyways, <laughs> elephants could actually get sunburned, so they put the dirt on their backs to protect their skin. Mm-hmm. Yeah. They're... <laughs> I mean, I'm sure they find it fun or something, but it's not just for, it's not like some kind of instinct thing that they do, or it's not like a bath, really. It's more like they, uh, it's sun protection. That's their sunblock, the dirt. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't, well, I mean, I, yeah, before, before I really got into like looking into elephants, I really didn't know that either. See, aren't they just like interesting creatures? Don't you just want one? <laughs> I know there's no way I could have one, but if I could, a girl can dream. If we had elephant together, what would we name it? <laughs> that sounds like a silly question, but I don't know what I'd name it. I want to name it Benson. I don't know why. I just want to like say, hey, Benny, and then he comes running. <laughs> I don't know. I just love elephants so much. <laughs> yeah, see, they can run pretty fast. You'd be surprised. <laughs> no, really, you're gonna get me something elephant themed for my birthday now? Hey, I'll, I'll accept it and I'll take it. Hmm. <laughs> Oh, yeah, you're right. We do have all those boxes by the front. Hmm. Well, we could always work on that and pause the movie for now. <laughs> now that I think about it, oh gosh, I don't think we've even done any unpacking since we got here. I think we just unpacked the essentials and then just, like, just left the rest of the boxes. And, you know, there are a lot of boxes in here, too. Right, there's literally a box right by the TV. <laughs> Yeah, I suppose that would be the responsible thing to do. And besides, I think this place deserves a little bit of spiffing. It's a little bit bare right now. The apartment's a little bit too bare for my taste. Some decorating, I think, is in order. And I did pack some nice stuff. <laughs> hey, you're the one that mentioned the boxes. No, you can't take that. No, come on, come on. We can pause this and watch it later. I mean, I know I said it was a relaxing day, but decorating the apartment can be fun, too. And I may or may not have some elephant, you know, little trinkets packed away. <laughs> okay, I only have a few. I have, like, a few little tiny statues that I got. I've collected a few, you know, elephant memorabilia. <laughs> Don't make fun of me. Here, come on, come on, come on. Besides, I feel like I need to stretch my legs a little bit. They're getting a little restless. <laughs> All right, let's see what's in box number one. <laughs> okay, okay, and maybe I brought a little bit more than just three elephant little knickknacks. Um, come on, isn't the throw blanket cute? You know, it's so funny. <laughs> I totally didn't line up the documentary with this. I swear this wasn't planned. So it's kind of funny that through relaxing and watching a bit of the documentary together, you learn that I'm a bit obsessed with elephants. A just a little bit. <laughs> I also packed some other stuff too. Like, um, hmm, let's look in this box. <laughs> yeah, here's my anime wall scrolls. I, I am a I am a nerd at heart. And uh da -da. I think I packed some like kitchenware in one of the boxes, but we may have actually already unpacked that. <laughs> What's in your boxes, hmm? You're <laughs> you're poking fun of me. What's in yours? 
Oh, you packed some photo frames of us? I totally forgot you even had this in your old apartment. Aww. <laughs> You're sweet. Here, where should we put this photo? I think it needs to go center stage somewhere. We don't really have a mantle, but... Here, let's put it right here. Mm -hmm. The main coffee table. That way anybody who comes in, they can see how happy we are together. <laughs> if they already can't guess it because, you know, we're living together. But some people live together and they're not happy, so... We got it pretty made. <sighs> let's see. And then we can put the elephant... I'll, I'll, I'll fold it in half. But we can just put the elephant, th like, throw blanket just right there on the couch. You know, so we can cuddle up together in the evenings. <laughs> and uh let's see what else do we got in here we gotta unpack <laughs> gosh a lot of clothes we'll leave that for later we'll leave that for later <laughs> uh we're doing some fun decorating right now not putting away clothes hmm oh, oh. <laughs> i didn't know you had that i totally forgot i gave that to you um yeah, uh, uh, oh. Yeah, put it by the front entryway. Mm hmm I think it'll look nice there. And then, um, hmm. Yeah, we can just, some of these, like, little knickknacks in here, we can just put around, around some of the tables and stuff, and then, uh, hang up some of the picture frames. And, uh, ch -ch 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 -ch. <laughs> oh, we even have this little tiny box of magnets that we got. Put them on the fridge. You know, I'd ever understand why people don't use magnets on their fridge. It just makes it so much more homey, you know? And more colorful. And, you know, homey and colorful are very pleasing to me. <laughs> oh, this is my favorite magnet. No, no, it's actually not the elephant one. <laughs> uh, I don't think I, uh... Oh, yeah, I do have an elephant magnet, but no, 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 it's, um, it's this one. When we went and picked apples together that one time, and then we took a photo, and then we made the photo into a magnet. You know, just for kicks. I'll put that one right up there. <laughs> hmm? Oh, yeah, of course I still have that. Mm-hmm. <laughs> That was the stuffed animal you got me for my birthday. Of course I still have it. I mean, I know you got it back from me when we were still friends, you know. Um, but... Of course I kept it. <laughs> Quite frankly, <laughs> I'm surprised I didn't unpack that sooner. Well, because I technically, you know, used to sleep with it. <laughs> I, I know it sounds stupid, but it... I don't know. It was nice thinking that you were that close to me, even back when we were just friends. But, you know, it's definitely grew. <laughs> it's, definitely ga it's definitely gained a lot more meaning now that we're together. But it was still special back then, too, so. <laughs> I guess we could put that one in the bedroom. <laughs> Unless you want to keep it out here, but I'll probably take it with me when I go to bed. Hmm. <laughs> Let's see, uh, I guess we can unpack one more box. Oh! Did you get this? Oh, I, yeah, I really like it. It, where did you even get this rug? I'm not, I would have never thought to, like, pack a rug or get a rug. But I, I think it really, yeah, let's, um, hmm, where do you think we should put it? Yeah, yeah, we should put it... Yeah, here, let me, um... Here, you grab that end, and I'll grab this end. Where did you get this rug? It's, like, a really nice big rug. Yeah, it really just ties the room together. All right, let me just... Place it down, and... Smooth out the edges, and... That looks... Really great. Yeah, you gotta steal on that. <laughs> I think it goes nice with all the little tiny elephant knickknacks. <laughs> um, 
Oh, gosh. I've been doing this for a bit now. What time is it? Hmm. Well, I suppose we can start thinking about what we're going to have for a dinner. <laughs> we woke up pretty late, so our breakfast was more or so like a lunch, so I'm actually getting pretty hungry. Hmm. <laughs> well, yeah, we have those frozen meals in there, but those are kind of like for last. I don't know. I feel like, hmm. What should we make? Something that's, like, something we can make that's quick, but yet isn't complete garbage. <laughs> hmm. That's a good idea. Yeah, yeah, I think, I think we have that in, I think we have that stuff in the fridge. We can, I think we can make that. <laughs> hmm. All right, here, you get some of the ingredients. And I'll get some of the ingredients. And I'm pretty sure if we work together, we can get it done pretty fast. And then we can eat and, um, what do you want to do? <laughs> oh, what do I want? Okay, I guess I've been asking you what you want to do. What do I want to do? Uh, well, I think it'd be nice just to have a nice dinner. And then just cut a little bit before we gotta go to bed. I think that sounds nice. <laughs> okay. And there we go. This turned out really nice. Who knew you were such a talented cook? Oh yeah, I did help out. I mean, it was a team effort. <laughs> mm. I already said this this morning, but... <laughs> it's... It's so cool that this is what life is going to be like now. I mean, obviously, I think we're a bit in the honeymoon phase with, you know, we just moved in together. I'm sure there's, <laughs> I'm sure it's not going to be this easy all the time. Or maybe it is, and we're just lucky. But, um, you know, we get to spend all this time together, and, you know, in our downtime, we're together in this apartment, together, and that's just, <sighs> I don't know, I'm just really excited to do all the regular things with you, like waking up and brushing my teeth, <laughs> making dinner like today. You know, I mean, I know before we did things together, like we, you know, we still cuddled and watched movies and sometimes we'd have sleepovers, but now it's, it's more real or I don't know. You know what I mean? It just has a different feeling to it. <laughs> and... I don't know. I think just having a full day where we just did all these random normal things, it really just solidified that for me. <laughs> I love you so much. <laughs> Alright, you should probably eat this before it gets cold. Hmm. <laughs> This is really good. My compliments to the chef, which is technically both me and you, so. <laughs> no, stop. I am that cute when I eat. Don't even. <laughs> You've been giving me too many compliments today. But hey, if this is what living with you is like, then I'll take it. <laughs> stop staring at me. Eat your food. <laughs> it's gonna go cold. I mean, granted, it is pretty hot, so it'd probably stay warm for a while, but <laughs> eat your food. <laughs> well, I'd say that was pretty good. Now I feel tired again. <laughs> It's been a pretty lazy day. We wake up late. We literally eat, sit around. You know, maybe unbox a little bit, be a little bit productive. We eat again. <laughs> and now I'm feeling tired again. What do you say? We put these dishes in the dishwasher and then, uh... Maybe, uh... 
just cuddle and talk a bit before bed. <laughs> Sounds like a plan. All right, come on. Oh, you know it. I am not ready for this weekend to be over. You got a full scheduled day tomorrow. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, yeah, no. I looked at the schedule um, on Friday before the weekend started, and we got a packed day tomorrow. Busy, busy Monday. So it's probably best that we're going to bed just a tad bit early. Okay, maybe not a tad bit early. It is like 10 o'clock, but <laughs> we're not staying up till midnight or anything. <laughs> well, you know, I'm still technically your boss, you know. <laughs> Stop it. Oh no, believe me, I'd love to make the schedule a little bit less packed, but... Mm, it is what it is. Got some big clients coming in, so... Had to think ahead. It was nice, though, today to not think about all those things. <laughs> Sometimes I do forget that I'm actually your boss. It's weird to say now, but... Oh gosh. <laughs> Nothing. It's just, you know, they say not to like <laughs> make relationships in the workplace. You did the total opposite of that. And usually those things just crash and burn. But ours did the exact opposite of crash and burn. I think it, things are actually still running smoothly. And I'm really grateful that it did happen because I'm really happy I have you in my life at least in this way now <laughs> I know we were friends before so I technically you were in my life but not in that way so so yeah I'm really glad that day you told me that you liked me because I don't think I would have had the courage to ask you out, so. <laughs> well, actually, I did, didn't I? I actually did. I ran down the hall like a crazy person, and in front of all the staff, I asked you out. And I don't regret it for one minute. <laughs> I know, I know. I know we gotta go to sleep, but then that means... And when I wake up, even though when I get to wake up next to you, that means that we gotta go to work. I don't want to go to work. Even though I really, really sh need to show up to work, because I... Without me, the whole operation fails. <laughs> well, yeah, are you kidding me? I had to keep all those people in line. You know how many times I had to keep you in line? <laughs> uh... <laughs> No, no, I know. I still love you. Of course I do. It's been a long time since... <laughs> it's been a long time since that day, hasn't it? You know, um, I mean, the day that you confessed to me and then I ran down the hall and asked you out and then, you know, I think, was it like a week later, a couple days later, we had the first date or something, which then our co-workers showed up, which was weird. <laughs> It's been a few months since then. <laughs> time flies, doesn't it? <laughs> well, as long as time flies with you, then I'm okay. Here, come here. <laughs> You're the little spoon tonight. You're always the big spoon, and I'm the little spoon. <laughs> I just want to hold you, if that's okay. <laughs> I love you too. So, so, so much. Good 
Good night, honey. I'll see you in the morning.